and welcome to Healthy Discoveries, brought to you by the VCU Medical Center. I'm Mandy Setliff. Tonight's discovery spotlights a non-surgical treatment for a pediatric heart defect, a procedure that really gets the blood flowing. Drew Nelson has been an athlete all his life. So the diagnosis of a heart defect was a big surprise. We had an echocardiogram done and realized that there was a problem with his heart that one of the valves at birth did not open up properly. Drew had a congenital heart defect called a coarctation of the aorta, a crimp in the major artery leading out of the heart. Left untreated, it can cause some serious problems. The patient may be left with lifelong hypertension with its consequences of coronary artery disease, stroke, heart failure and requiring medications. Diagnosis of this heart defect is often missed, but according to Dr. Moskowitz, it shouldn't be. You don't need expensive tests, you don't need echocardiograms. If you're feeling the pulses in arms and legs and the leg pulses feel diminished, you can diagnose coarctation without any more than your hands. And treatment doesn't necessarily require surgery. A balloon catheter can be threaded into the artery to open up the blockage. What we're doing with coarctation of the aorta is to tear the membrane that was there congenitally, opening up the aorta, allowing the blood flow to become normal. You'll be able to see that now with the ballooning, the blood easily goes through that area. I think it was um, 10 days later, and he was hiking up a mountain. The recovery was that quick, and he felt so good. As always, the earlier the diagnosis, the better the long-term results. If you have any questions, give us a call at 1-866-828-3627. We'll see you next time. Good night.